So you need to run a local uh, email server, SMTP server, uh, for development or whatever reason. I'm going to show you how to do that. The server we're going to be running is Mail Slurper. It's an open source uh, email server that you can run from source, but I'm going to show you how to uh, run it uh, using Docker. So of course, the only prerequisite you need is Docker. Docker is one of the most important tools that you can have in your repertoire as a well-rounded software developer. So go install Docker now, uh, pause the video, and then come back when you have it uh, ready to go. So now that Docker is installed, the only thing that we have to do is pull up a terminal and then run this command, docker run, dash it, uh, which means interactive. And then uh, the, the next three commands or arguments, I should say, uh, we're going to map three ports on our host, uh, 2500, which is our uh, SMTP server. We're going to expose that so that we can um, send email to it locally. Uh, 8080, that's the web interface or um, the inbox that we can log on to a browser. And then 8085, I have no idea what that is. If you know, let me know down in the comments. Um, and then the last command is the actual name of the Docker image. Someone has already packaged Mail Slurper into a Docker image. And all we have to do is give the name of the, uh, the, the Docker image. And then um, our Docker CLI will pull it from the cloud and then run it locally. Okay, so now we just uh, have to run it and uh, let Docker take care of the rest. So uh, we hit enter, it's running, and you can see that uh, it started, and um, there's the SMTP listener, uh, the actual mail server itself, listing on 2500, port 2500 on localhost, and the uh, web browser is uh, being served on 8080. Next up, we're just gonna open up a web browser, go to localhost 8080, and you can see that we actually have the inbox here. Uh, so now let's run a little script to send some uh, email to our mail server. Uh, just using wget to run it right through the CLI. And uh, we do that, and now you can see we've, uh, we've sent some email to our email server. And just like that, we've run a local mail server and uh, sent it some emails. Thank you for watching.